Welcome back to News 46. The League of Women Voters held their annual Women of Distinction Queen's Tea at Nevada Treasure RV Resort. The League of Women Voters is a political organization that doesn't support any candidate, any party. What it supports is people voting and knowing who they're voting for and why. And this year, available online, is a website called vote411.org. All candidates in Nevada for any office were sent invitation to supply information to Vote 411 and it would be entered without change so that nobody could claim they were misquoted. So this is something that voters should really uh, look into yes. before they're going to the poll. Right. If you have a computer, go to vote411.org. If you don't have a computer, use your iPhone. If you don't have an iPhone, go to the library. Yeah, the library has fiber optics right now, so it's pretty fast. <laughs> right. So they should use their library because they have the equipment. So uh, today, the Women of Distinction, there was a, quite a few nominees. Tell me about that. We uh, send letters to all the local organizations for whom we can find addresses, and we ask them to please nominate someone from their group who they feel has done an over and above board service to Pahrump. And that's how we, they, they choose the person and they do the write-up, and then we go ahead and do what we did here today. We read all of it and give them a nice certificate and a rose, and. Everybody feels really special because those are the people who are usually behind the scenes and don't really get recognized. Exactly. It's amazing when you read the list on of all the things that these people have done. Well, that's why I told every woman here today that even if they didn't get a certificate, they are women of distinction because they do a lot of work for the community with others and they need to be a recognized for it. Um, Francis, everybody was wearing their fancy clothes, their hats. Tell me about that. That's uh, That started a couple of years ago and we decided to do a hat contest and it has mushroomed every year someone tries to outdo and it looks like we had a repeat winner here again today. But It went really well, it, didn't it, here at Nevada Treasure RV Resort. If people want to join the League of Women Voters, can they do that? Yes, they can. They can call 727 3978. That's our home phone number. And all they need to do is give us a name, address. We'll send them an application. Producer Nadine Medell talks about the upcoming short film, Last Plane to Nowhere, filmed locally during the High Desert International Film Festival. I'm normally a planner when it comes to film, and so I was really hesitant about doing a guerrilla microshoot, but it was super fun. Um, Ron and Warren and yourself and Linda and all the local folks were so gracious and so wonderful in helping us get it going, and it was super fun. And good. Um, so, did you like the location? Was it really good? And Roy Mankins let us use his airport. That was kind of oh, it's amazing. My, my last film was filmed in a junkyard and I just I just love anything industrial um, so junkyards or uh, in New Jersey they have all those containers like for miles and miles and just stacked it's amazing and I just feel like that kind of stuff you can't set it in a film um, and so Roy's place specifically, um, he's been collecting all that stuff for 40 years, so it's real, it's authentic, and um, and that just really comes through, and that's production value that you can't buy in a film. All right, your perump weather when we come back.